Yeah, it's Hobbs Horror, knocking down your door, all about the guts and gore, blood and pus, give him some more, he wants bone and entrails for across the floor, so if you're looking for that theater macabre, bruh, look no more, sit back and relax and enjoy some Hobbs Horror. Thank you for watching Hobbs Horror, Hobbs Horror, Hobbs Horror. Yeah, and don't forget to like and subscribe and all that good shit, good shit, good shit, good shit, What is up everybody, this is Hobbs here for you. Everybody's always asking me, what'd you get for this month, or show me your collection. So what I've decided to do is, at the end of the month, I will show you what I purchased. <clears throat> Not necessarily what was sent to me to review. That way you guys can see what I got in on. Now, I'm not made of money, so I don't buy like a lot of other people do. I use gift cards primarily, or if I see something for really cheap, I'll grab it. So, with that being said, this is January's end of the month haul. What I have. This is the Grease 4K uh, Ultra HD Edition. I used to have the yearbook edition, but I got rid of that because I wanted to upgrade to the 4K. So that is Grease. We have the High Note. I have not watched this. I really bought this to give out, <laughs> so somebody would be getting that. But it does have cube in it, so I might have to watch it because it's got cube in it. Ice cube. Uh, this is Blackbird. Again, a one I purchased at Dollar Tree to give out or give away. It's too depressing for me. I don't think I can handle Blackbird. Uh, this is Adrift. I reviewed that on my channel. This movie was okay. Can't say that it was anything that, um, for me personally, has a lot of rewatch value, but I did enjoy it for what it was. Adrift. This might have been towards the end of December, but we're going to count it for January. This is the Top Gun 4K HD. I'm trying to get the 4K HD with the Blu ray scan because I've got the TV, just not the player. So I just need to do that, and then that way I can continue to look at maybe upgrading the HD. There's the back. And then my last three are my Steelies I got for the month. Firefly Trilogy. Had to have this. Had to have it. Smooth cover art. Just beautiful all around. Absolutely beautiful. Love it. We have the Warriors Steelbook. Again, these were under $20 with the special I got. Very, very cool Steelbooks. And last but not least, finally, we got this My Bloody Valentine Steely. No, I'm not a Steelbook collector. I just found a deal on Steelbooks. But maybe down the road I'll get more. I don't know. But, um, this is the Shout Factory Edition, I believe. Yeah, Shout Factory Edition. I watched this the other day. This is the best picture I've seen of this particular film. I know the 4K is going to look beautiful, but, I mean, it's hard to spend that kind of money without, you know, knowing if I could have gotten a good scan with this. And this is a beauty. This is the best I've seen the picture um, overall. But, yeah, that's... Everything I got for the month of January. I hope you enjoyed this. This will be a recurring theme. Uh, I probably won't do individual mini updates. I'll just do like an end of the month pickup. I would say overall out of pocket. Maybe. Maybe 80 bucks total for all this. With gift, and that includes the cost with the gift cards. So you know two or three gift cards at 25 bucks a piece. I'm not really out any money too much. So yeah. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and we'll look forward to seeing you in February for the February Hall update. Peace.